Okay, so there's now an emulator for the 3DO on Android that's a functioning emulator, not the one in RetroArch. Um, this emulator, actually I've been waiting for a 3DO, em 3DO emulator on Android for a while, I'm probably the only person. <laughs> um, but this one is called Real 3DO Player, and it's full speed. The only thing is there's few things, it's fairly new, and it's very simple, there's no external gamepad support. So I'm using the, the shield, I'm using the gamepad mapper uh, to get the buttons to map. And there's really no settings, it just launches games, and you, honestly, you can't put your games on the external SD card, for now. Uh, so that's a big limitation right now. I'm sure they will update it and um, get it e get it to <laughs> allow you to, to store your ROMs and BIOS files on the SD card, external SD card. So we're gonna launch it right now. This see, this is uh, this is it. It's that simple. Uh, you can launch the uh, BIOS file, or you can launch the game. Because um, I have the gamepad mapper running. Oh, okay, it, it doesn't activate until you actually start the game. I didn't even know that. Okay, so this is Killing Time. It's the only game I have on here right now, but it runs just fine. I'm off the rocky coast of Maine, heading toward the island of Botanicus alone. My Egyptology professor, Dr. Hargrove, was always... Okay. So, here we are. There's not much in the options menu. Okay. Now, create my name. I thought I already had. Wait. Is there no way to get back? Okay. Well, apparently I can't get out of here. Alright. I had a profile already. Oh, I need to. Because it's forcing me to, I have to create a profile, I guess. Oh, let's see. Okay, I, did, I was able to get back. Using the select button for me. Alright, so... This is where I left off. I didn't really go far into the game. Uh, er, okay. <laughs> Just making sure. Alright, so here I am. This is uh, Killing Time. Not everybody really cared for this game. But I did. I never had a 3DO as a kid, and I had two 3DOs a few years back, and they were both broken. Uh, I don't think, I have no ammo. I, have a, I had a gun, but I, I switched it to the shotgun, and uh, I don't have any ammo. And I don't see a way to switch the gun back. Not the best controls in this game, but I just like the atmosphere. It's weird. <laughs> I would like to be able to get a gun or some ammo or something. Because I don't have any other way to defend myself. So, yeah, I, if there's a way to defend myself, I don't know it. Uh, any button combinations for changing weapons? Um, anything? How do I change weapons? Any way to do such a thing? No, I guess not. Be nice if there was, but I guess it's time to die. Oh, wait. Nope. That's of no help. So the idea is run. Oh shit. Okay. Fuck. Ah! 
Yeah, so this is uh, the 3DO emulator. Um, it works great, just like needs uh, controller support, true controller support, not this touchscreen stuff. Um, uh, you know, it needs the ability to play your ROMs off the SD card. Um, yeah. Probably some, some widescreen stuff or whatever, but it's new, so it works. That's my most important thing, is if you release an emulator, please make it work. Just make it work, goddammit. And we'll worry about the stupid stuff later. But if you do it all, that's great, but not everybody can, so. But that's that. Thank you for watching.